Welcome to Kinsler Fuel Injection. I'm Greg Murchison, General Manager. Today we will be showing you the K140 bypass valve and why it is the ultimate high speed. There are two basic types of bypass valves, poppet jet can styles and diaphragm styles. The K140 high speed is designed for competition racing and is the most repeatable on the market. It is partially based off the IRL pressure relief valve. It is a lightweight and compact, built using aluminum components that are truly hard coat anodized for protection. It has the highest flow capability with the least amount of pressure rise of any valve. It has many unique features. Self-centering live action pintle for superior sealing. The pintle and the seat are micro lapped and polished for a bubble tight seal. The springs rest in a carrier that travels in the tower which has a polished bore for smooth movement. Valves are built with different combination of springs to achieve a broad range of pressures from 20 to 200 psi. Very special proprietary diaphragm material which is compatible with methanol, ethanol, E85 and race gas. The thinness of the material improves the reaction. Two are used for added safety. Diaphragms are replaceable and a service kit is available. The K140's opening and closing or hysteresis loop is the best of any valve of any type. This keeps the fuel mixture the same as the RPM increases and or decreases. If a valve has poor hysteresis, the fuel mixture is never more than a compromise. Every valve's components are inspected, measured, and recorded for quality control. Each valve is then flowed and the testing results recorded. After assembling the valve, it is then put on the flow bench and tested for operation. The valve is then ran through a hysteresis test checked for sealing, then pressure set at the customer's requested setting. The valve's pressure engagement point can be changed with the adjusting screw. The amount of bypass flow can be changed by using a restrictor jet installed in the pod on the inlet of the valve. The black line shows the fuel system without a high speed. The red line is the K140 without a restrictor jet. Note that the fuel system has very nominal flow increase to the engine. The green line is with an 076 thousandths restrictor jet, making the fuel system richer than no jet. The pink line is with an 66 thousandths restrictor jet, making the fuel system richer than the 076. The vent is to allow atmospheric pressure and temperature to equalize in the tower, so no differential builds up. Keeping dirt out of the tower is very important. The springs and carrier have a molly lube on them. Dirt can contaminate the molly, causing the valve to perform poorly. The newest option is the flush mounted side filter. This allows easier access to the adjusting screw. Not everyone has a flow bench available to them, so we offer the part number 5991 single gauge high pressure tester. It consists of a high quality precision 0 to 160 PSI gauge with a 4 inch face, glycerin filled, stainless steel tube and socket, 1% full scale accuracy, grade 1A with 2 PSI increments, stainless steel case, laminated safety glass, billet aluminum adapter block with adjustable regulator and connector fittings. There is a valve for you, whether you're a drag racer, a puller, 
road racer, or sprinter running a midget, 305, 360, or 410. For more information, see our handbook catalog online at kinsler.com. If you have any questions, please contact us via the website, email, or by telephone. Thank you.